find the lengths of these three line segments. So, hope you guys remember this from class. We made a square like these. And uh, that square, by the way, <clears throat> uh, that would have an area. So on at these, I made a square, and I can find the area of that square. <laughs> no, I am doing it right here. So if I looked at this triangle right account, that's half of this square right account. So that tells us that the area of that triangle is, let me get, because uh, that would have an area of four. So the area of this one is two. So if we split this up, this one is two, two, and two. And so the area of the square is eight. So the length of this one, the side length is the square root of eight, which also simplifies. So A is two times the square root of two. All right, Isaac's going to explain how he did part B. Thank you. All right, so, so this little line thing, where is the color? There it is. How do you erase that? All right, well, this is the line. It has, like, two spaces in between, like these little spaces, like, right there and right there. So that's one per space. So there's two spaces right there. I did the uh, square root of two. It's two, 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 two. It's not writing. You gotta take your hand off the pad. Oh, oh. <laughs> nope, still not doing it. Dope. That is a two. Plus the square, the two, and a two. And then that's this four. Oh, I'm going off. Oh, shoot. All right, go down here. Four plus four, and then that's square root of eight, and that is two. Well, then the, this is the answer. Did you do A or B? <laughs> I did A, because I was doing the other Oh, that's way. A, okay, that's fine. All right, well, I hope that made sense for you guys. Um, McKenna's going to do B, though. I'm going to show how to do B. Just This is a different way, all right? So if I make a triangle like these, this is a side length of four and that's a side length of three. So the diagonal like these would be the square root of four squared plus three squared. Yes, and that is what Isaac did. Again, I hope you understood it though. So that's a square root of 16 plus old niner, which is the square root of 25, which is a five. So B is a five. And A, we already have uh, 2 times the square root of 2. And C. All right, let's do it Isaac's way again because you guys like it. Yeah. So this is the length of 2. That's the length of 3. Can I have an easier way than that way? Well, hold on. Let's do 2 squared plus 3 squared. The square root of this action. That gives us the square root of 4 plus 9, four plus nine which is the square root of 13. And that is And that is it. You can't simplify this anymore. See square root of 13. Yes.